We are a professional training and coaching organization that helps you unleash your potential. <laughs> I could just be on film and smile all the time. <laughs> I could do that maybe. We are a professional training and coaching organization that energizes, motivates and inspires your people. <laughs> they love those words, by the way. <laughs> they don't ask. They don't ask, like, how do you do that then? <laughs> what does that mean? Sometimes they ask, what's it, what's it going to mean to the bottom line? <laughs> I say, well, it, it costs a lot. So it's going to go down first, but then it's going to give a lot. So then it'll go up. And now in almost 10 years, I only ever get people saying thank you. And boy, is that different than when I was in corporate life. <laughs> you know, everybody says thank you. Individuals and, and directors and customers just say thanks. It's a wonderful thing. And given that I like to be happy all the time, <laughs> and you can't get better, better input than that. It, it far outweighs any monetary compensation. When we first started, this business and got into this world, we struggled with the labels trainer and coach and training and coaching because we kind of arrogantly felt that didn't describe what we were going to do and what we wanted to achieve. And a d friend of ours pointed us at a Dutch word which has no translation in any other language. The word is employing and it kind of melts together things like discover, unfold, unleash, all those sorts of things, as well as develop, blah, blah, blah. That you can't use, of course, as a label for your business, but it was like, yeah, that's what we do. I see lots of potential in people. I think everybody's got great stuff. Everybody's got super characteristics. Everybody has great talents and strengths and qualities and so forth. And why I do what I do, a big part of it is I want to help them to be able to use more of that. Because I know from my own personal experience and that of many others, that if they're able to do that, then they're gonna have more fun. And when they're having more fun and they're able to use that stuff, they do great work. One of our customers, they wanted to get into the top 10 of being a great place to work in their country. And they weren't even on the radar screen. And two years after, we did a program for the whole company. And they not only ended up in the top 10, they were the number one best place to work. Now that was just amazing results, a tangible result. Now, of course, that wasn't just our program. Our program was just a catalyst, but it gave them a common language. It, it brought everybody together with common goals and purpose. It enabled them to start really using all the good stuff they had at an individual and collective level, and it had that result. And not only that, four years later, their business has gone from success to success to success. big word in our area at the moment is being authentic, being yourself. And the problem with all these words and these cliches is they're true. <laughs> that's, that's what I want to do. I want to help people to be themselves. To, but they to, in order to do that, you have to, as for yourself, you have to be able to look in the mirror and be happy with what you see. I'm really happy to be me. And I am me wherever I go in any situation. I don't, people sometimes get a little bit shocked by me because I'm quite huggy, you know, I'm, I'm quite tactile. And I, I kiss men 
you know, and, and some men initially are sort of a bit, hmm. <laughs> I don't, you know, not the first time I go in and meet the CEO of a company, end up giving him three kisses on the cheek, something, but, but I, I, myself, I'm always been very warm, very, very tactile, and to me, it's an expression of the relationship that I feel. And it doesn't matter to me whether that's with a family member, a friend, or a customer. I feel that it's important for me to share what I've got. I have lots of energy, I have lots of positive energy. And I see lots of people who don't have that. And it's not that I'm philanthropic about it, it just feels I want to do that. I can't tell you where the urge comes from. I just know I like to do it, I love to do it. It makes me feel good. So it's all self-gratification, <laughs> I suppose. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's the way it is. <laughs> One of my philosophies in life. <laughs>